A Testament Against the World, The Lord's Rebuke. You have entered in. January 31st, 2011. From the Lord our God and Savior, the Lord's words spoken to Timothy during an online fellowship. For all those who have ears to hear. Thus says the Lord, Who are all these before me? What people is this who have despised me? These who walk proudly, hating me and my word. Ignorant and sinful people. You have become as false gods in my eyes. Detestable idols. Each one of you, from the least to the greatest, have turned from me to worship your idols and corrupted images. You worship yourselves. Yes, you uphold every false image and detestable doctrine with which you spit in my face. You flee all accountability and rest comfortably in your sin, bearing a multitude of bitter fruit in unrighteousness. Lawless people! You have despised me and my law. Therefore, around your necks shall it be strewn, and you shall bear its weight, every jot and every tittle, says the Mighty One, the God of Jacob. Here I am, the God of all, the God of recompense and judgment. My peoples, hear the word of the living God. All peoples of the earth, hear the voice of of your Maker. You have all entered in. The day is here, and you have entered in. The day of the Lord. Therefore, bow down heavily, fall on your faces, and wail loudly. Cry out! Die to yourselves, and grab hold of the Holy One of Israel and pray that you are counted worthy to escape. I lie not. You have entered in. Lo, did I not say to you that your knowledge was useless, and all your thoughts and imaginings were in vain? For I am the Lord, and I do according to the counsel of my own will. For the scholars cry, false, and the Christians plot in vain against my messengers. And the people of Israel walk proudly, exalting themselves by their own knowledge. Though they remain ignorant, for the truth is still hidden from their eyes. My own sheep stumble. The whole world falls down and is broken. When? O oh, peoples, will you cast yourselves down? When will you be humbled? When will you forsake your knowledge and be free? I am the Lord. Even I am He. There is no knowledge apart from me, and there can be no understanding, save it was given you by Mashiach. He is your master. Have you not felt these pangs, O earth? Have you not recoiled in pain, O heavens? Has not fear grabbed hold of you, O mighty nations? Blind and hard peoples, repent! I am calling all peoples to repent and to turn. My face is turned against you. My shoulders are set. My hand is stretched forward. Woe, woe, woe to those who dwell upon the earth. The fire is kindled. All flesh shall burn. I shall strike the animals, and they shall rage against you. I shall strike the waters, and they shall rise up against you. From bitterness to the raging of the seas, the waters shall oppress you. 
Death shall increase quickly. I shall strike the mountains, and they shall speak, and bring forth a great noise. They shall consume you, and bury your cities. I shall strike the heavens, and it shall rain down fire and flooding rain, with a great multitude of hail. Lo, even the detestable birds who dwell there shall descend upon you, and torment you seven days. I shall strike the core of the earth, and it shall be shaken. And all manner of plagues shall ascend upon you from beneath. For I am the Lord who reigns, he who laid the foundations, he who formed it and causes to be. Behold, I am also he who shall bring forth a swift end. For the whole earth is but a footstool beneath my feet, a rock in my hand made of limestone, easily broken. A great war has broken forth. The battle is waged. Yet the Lord's hand is not at all weakened. Behold, my strength is increased, and my wrath overflows my cup. I am coming down. I shall rob, and I shall pillage, and I shall surely take my spoil. I shall oppress the oppressors and conquer the land. I shall kill the generals and slaughter the captains, and tear all mighty men to pieces. For strong is the Lord. Behold, I am about to send out my company. I am about to call upon my witnesses. I shall send each one into the heat of battle. And with their staff they shall scatter great armies set in battle array. They shall break through the lines and leap over battlements, striking down their staffs. Behold, the ground beneath shall buckle, it shall crack, and the hand of the Lord shall pass through. The wind of the Lord shall spread forth outward in all directions to destroy, and all their devices shall be severely rent, left twisted beyond recognition. Strong is the Lord, hot is his anger. Lo, the word of my mouth shall speak, and the whole world shall be turned on its side. Behold, the earth shall give way to the sound of my voice and the power of my name. Even through the mouths of my witnesses shall my word speak, and mighty men shall crumble. Fire shall come down from heaven at their command and consume their enemies. I am the Lord. They shall be sent to every city, and they shall pronounce my judgment. And the cities of men shall be condemned. Therefore they shall be hated. Therefore shall the whole world loathe the sight of them. For destruction runs ahead of them, and fire follows close behind. Lo, the Lord your God has prepared destroying angels. Behold, I am sending both. Those from below shall be released to destroy and kill, and those in heaven shall be sent down to fulfill my command, to pronounce and carry out my judgment. They are swift, and they shall fly to and fro in all the earth, blowing a loud trumpet, carrying fire and wrath. And some shall protect, while others slaughter. Yet in my witnesses, I myself shall come to dwell. Woe to all who come against them. I am Yahweh.